A parent in Dorchester School District 2 says he wants to see certain books pulled from library shelves. That's right. News 2's Jordan Siopa was in Somerville and tells us about the measure that he's taking to get this done. Nearly 160 books at Dorchester School District 2 have been challenged for allegedly containing inappropriate material. While one parent I spoke with is taking this a step further by reaching out to state leaders and the Dorchester County Sheriff's Office. Bruce Budnick is the parent of a fourth and fifth grader attending Beach Hill Elementary School in Dorchester School District 2. He has concerns about a list of books he says are found inside the district libraries. When do you get a normal book where it says a uh, warning? And then you start reading it and saying to yourself, the sister life. And he goes on and on about very pornographic information. I'm going, I don't want my kids to do that. Nearly 160 books at DD2 have recently been challenged for allegedly containing inappropriate content. Earlier this year, the school board discussed the process for reviewing these books. For Budnick, the solution is simple. The librarian can go up there and pull those books out really quickly. Uh, forget about them, how they got in there. They're there. Budnick says he's been in contact with the governor's office about this matter. Last month, he also sent over the list of books to the Dorchester County Sheriff's Office. One thing led to another, and all of a sudden I got um, an email and some questions, and they wanted some detailed information on, they wanted to know the book, the page, etc. And I said, it's not just one page. It's books, it's, it's photographs, it's pages and pages of books material. An incident report provided to News 2 by DCSO shows someone else reached out to the sheriff's office this week with the same complaint, alleging 160 books at DD2 contain pornographic passages. Meanwhile, Budnick says the sheriff's office told him his inquiry was recently passed over to a solicitor. As for his next steps. I'm not putting him to bed until we get these books out of the school. And then the second step is to make sure that those don't go back in the school. A spokesperson for DD2 says the district has not received any inquiry from law enforcement concerning library books. Reporting in Somerville, I'm Jordan Siopa, Count on Two.